Oh, we're going into Wood Tick. Don't go on that bridge. There's like the. Oh, uh, don't. Oh. I just like this bit because the, the, the player always feels like they've, they've done something wrong. Right, without because, knowing it. Yeah. People like would actually go back and try and play this again <laughs> to, to try and not get caught by him on the bridge. Yeah, uh, Largo La Grand is named after where I grew up. Largo? Oh, yeah. Key Largo? No, I grew up in La Grand, <laughs> Oregon. So that's where I, where I got his name. Where'd the Largo come from? I don't know. I always liked how he started out with a whole bunch of money. So you kind of thought he, he had a bunch of stuff, and then it all like completely goes away at the very beginning. Yeah, of the game. that fit into the ro uh, running theme of mean, cruel things that we enjoyed. <laughs> <laughs> Give the player a bunch of money and then take it away from them. And just take it all away from them immediately. Yeah. Yep. I just want to say how good looking Guybrush's hair is looking in this game. He has a new stylist in this game. Yeah. Look how big his eyes are in the. Okay, sorry. Wasn't the uh, the the money thing? Uh, inspired by just how, how much time you spent in the first game having to get money like it was a really big thing like oh you didn't have any money and you had to go mm -hmm. go to the circus, circus and, and get a job and all that and right. it's like, and this I, time let's start them off right. with tons of money more money they know to do and we're going to take it all away oh, we'll take, okay here is the big premiere of iMuse right yes. this is mm -hmm. the biggest and I think the biggest ever most complicated piece of iMuse music that was ever made we had like two like full-time programmers who are doing nothing but programming the iMuse transitions. Because like, it's a main theme outside, and then every time you go into one of these inner locations or inside the, the house, it would enable or disable instruments, and it right. would change the theme a little right. bit. Right, right. Yeah, no, iMuse was like absolutely amazing. <clears throat> this is totally Dave's room. I That's never, true, I never right? touched anything in this room. In here. Did I do the laundry guy as well? Yeah. I definitely remember I, I, I always got to write the uh, the, the men of a little moral, moral fiber. Yeah, and those are fun. your, mostly based on the three aspects of your personality. The three aspects Sloth, of your personality. <laughs> snarkiness, and brains. Right. Is there a brainy one? Wait. I think the guy on the edge, uh, the what, I think the he's... The fat guy sleeping, he's the brainy one. I think it's the tallest one, because usually the tallest people are the smartest. Mm -hmm. I think this may also be the, the last time I ever actually did a piece of art on one of our games. Wait, I remember me, something about that box guess and the rat puzzle. I painted something out. Yeah. Well, this was back when programmers could actually do final art. And for the game. art union. Yes. Back when everything. there were not that many colors in the game. Well, you know, Monkey Island 2 is a huge kind of revolution in art. Because Monkey Island 1 was just 16 colors. And then we were using the whole 256 color VGA palette for this. Because, you know, is, Peter Chan and all the markers, the scanner, wasn't it? Yeah, we yeah, bought we bought the scanner. scanner. This was the first, Peter Chan was new. He was like the, his name when we first hired Peter Chan was Scanboy. Right. And he Scan scanned this first, and he used right. markers, and everyone was mad that he used markers because right. they wanted to use paint. And we had to, we, we wrote that program that after the scan came in and all the colors, it crunched the colors down to the, like, 230 because we had to reserve mm -hmm. the upper was, like, 32 colors the for the characters. And, 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 and sort them all. And yeah. Uh oh. I think some separate Alligator. ones for the UI, too. Yeah, there were 16 colors for the UI, and then there were 32 colors for the characters, and then the rest, I think, were reserved for the backgrounds. Yeah. Remember color cycling? Oh, yeah. How awesome yeah, that good. seemed at the time. <laughs> 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 it was <laughs> magical. the best way to do waves laughing at a beach. Waves laughing at a beach. Any sort of beach. frame rate hit ever. I still use it there daily. <laughs> Thank you.